Hi guys, welcome back. I've got a whole video for you today slash lookbook. Basically, I went shopping at New Look and I'm totally and completely in love with their new collection. I won't say they've rebranded, but I do think they've added things to the brand, like the accessories, the home accessories, um, the makeup accessories, the makeup itself, um, beauty accessories, etc. Stuff like that. And they've pretty much smashed it, in my opinion. I may sound a bit nasally today because I've got a code, I've been battling it for the past week and I'm coming towards the end of this but I really wanted to get this video out and done with so I'm just going to try and keep it really short, really quick and concise. First I'm going to start with the nail polishes that I bought from them. As you can see some of them are gel, like that's a gel top coat, the black one, um, this uh, lilac -y muddy purple whatever colour it is that's a matte colour this is another gel one this nudie one this uh, green one here is was it gel no that's just regular nail polish and then this one's again red, regular nail polish so they do do a variety of nail polishes and I was spoiled for choice so I thought I'd get all of the different kinds that they do and try them out. I'm in love with all of these colours. Please ignore this ratchet nail. I was in the store trying one for colour on and I haven't had a chance to get my nails done yet. I really only wanted one colour and because they were so nice I couldn't say no basically. So you know this is how I got this situation here. It starts from $2.99 for the regular nail polish that starts from $2.99 and I think for like the gel colours those are $3.99 if I'm right. Um, it says here you use with this top coat one I'm gonna go off it says gel polish seven days wear high shine. I really like the packaging it comes in it's really cute I guess it's obviously just regular nail polish but when you lift the top of it off the lid comes off on its own don't know why. At first when I was in the store I was like, this looks cheap, but it does it with all of them. So I think that's just like the way it's designed and the way the products are meant to be. This was $2.99, it's rose gold, it's pretty. It comes with a little spare black rubber thing for the middle, yeah. And yeah, so that was nice and cheap. So next I have this coat, which is so cute, it's just, I got a bit of a stain here, I got some hair grease on it, so I need to figure out a way to clean this. Oops. Um, but I love this coat, so I really do hope that I can clean the stain, and if I can't clean it, I will buy another one, because I love it, like it's so nice. Funnily enough, it was £34, that's what the tag said on it, and when I got to the till, they were like, yeah, that's £10, please. I was like, no, no. Okay. I didn't ask no questions. I just paid the nice man the £10 that he requested and I got up out of there, okay? I was like, what? And it looks so nice on. You will see it in my video later on. It's just a long bomber. And let me just say this. One thing I love New Look for is their generation. Their generation collection is for like teens and I guess like children, not young children, but children and teens and this is actually an age 12 to 13 years old, this jacket. I actually tried on the 14 to 15 and that was huge. So I went a size down and got this. So I love how big their generation stuff are because then people like myself can get the price on the low low. Next, I have some pink power. I joke, I joke. I love this coat. I saw one in Topshop, but it was a lot shorter. This one actually is a bit longer. Again, you'll see it in the video in the lookbook later on. It was £44, which I was kind of like, I don't want to spend £44, but they did have student discount, and I really do like it. Next, I have some white pumps. These were £6. I basically bought them because I'm going on holiday next month, and I just wanted some cheap pumps to wear while I was away and um, I will be in the hot country I'm going to Dubai and I just wanted something that were cheap that was durable and that wouldn't get water or sand in them they are leather which is quite nice and um, so they look that little bit more smarter than like a canvas fabric okay so my favorite 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 purchases from this shop are these jeans 
did not know that New Look had such great pairs of jeans. Like, I'm so confused as to where I've been. Like, I don't understand how I'm only now catching on to New Look's denim. Their denim is amazing. The craziest thing is I actually used to work there when I was, I think, 16. But it's a completely different brand now than what it was then. And obviously, like, the products are different and stuff. But yeah, so I think once I stopped working there, because I'd worn only New Look because I got that 50% discount. <laughs> um, when I stopped working there because I didn't get the 50% off anymore, I was like, no, I ain't shopping there. I don't want to pay full price. But I got over that. Many years on, stumbled in New Look and came across their jeans and their denim range is amazing. The craziest thing is, it is so cheap. Like, not cheap as in the quality, but it's so affordable. The most I spent, I think, was... $27.99 and that was for this black pair here. I don't know why. Uh, the rest of it was $24.99. I don't know if that's their lowest price point nor their highest price point for denim. All I do know is it's cheap, okay? Because I used to shop in like Topshop and buy their jeans and I mean their jeans are great. However, I haven't got 40 to 45 pounds or 50 or 55. I don't know what their prices are saying nowadays, but I haven't got that much to buy a pair of jeans so often. So my jeans collection or my denim collection was becoming quite scarce. I know Topshop's not the only place that you can shop in, but it's the only place that I can shop in for denim because of, I just feel like they fit me best, Topshop jeans. So because I got so used to their fit, but because I know I struggle to find denim wear because of my body type and stuff, it, it, I just, looking for another place to buy jeans just wasn't really an option for me. Um, but now New Look is the place for me <laughs> when it comes to my denim wear. Because for the price that you get for one pair of jeans at Topshop, you can get the same, if not nicer, for half that price. No brainer. There's no point in me taking them off one by one and just showing you all the rips and stuff. So I'd rather just leave it at this point here and we'll go straight into the lookbook. I'm going to be wearing a plain white tee in the video just because I don't want the attention to be taken away from the denim and the jackets and the other little things that I'm excited about. So today I'm feeling in a bit of a, because I'm under the weather and I'm at home and it's a Sunday, I'm filming this on a Sunday, only God knows when y'all are gonna get this video, but today's Sunday. <laughs> I'm feeling a bit comfy. I think I'm gonna film this video barefoot. Mm -hmm. Y'all gonna see these toes, all right. And no, I ain't had no pedicure. My nails are not done. Sorry, I know I'm in a different position to where I was before. <laughs> I almost forgot these bad boys. They look like the Rihanna Puma slippers. Obviously, more affordable, coming in at the very nice price of $19.99. Yes, 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 yes. Any wants, any bits, any, any bits? No, no. Come in once, come in twice. So, with it, to me, okay? $19.99 for a pair of fluffy slippers. I can do that. I did want the Rihanna ones, but I don't. I didn't want to spend 60 pounds on some damn slippers, so you know, my cheap ass fed all these. But they're cute. I'm gonna wrap up the whole part and let's go straight into the lookbook. Stay tuned. <laughs> 